Nelson, congratulations, mate. Uh, you told me what you were going to do. You went over there. You, you did say you were going to win gold, but bloody hell, mate. Bronze isn't bad, is it? Yeah, it's not too bad. It's not too bad. Gold would have been better, but <laughs> can't even blame me with bronze. No, no, do you know, uh, both you and Levi uh, did something that. I don't think I. I think the last person I remember winning a bronze, who I know personally, was Connor Tewsbury. Oh, yeah. yeah. Uh, he went over in the world, it was the youth uh, a few years back now. Um, so an amazing achievement and uh, I, I, I was watching the, the semi-final uh, that he lost out to the Armenian who, who eventually won, yeah, won the competition yeah. didn't he? Um, I thought they were really harsh on you in that first round. Yeah. I, I thought I thought if you if anyone was going to get the first round it was going to be you. Yeah I thought so too but it's boxing you know take the ups with the downs haven't you? you know oh, I mean? Most definitely. Most I thought definitely. I definitely had the first round I didn't really get it much with the first round the second uh, the second was close he probably took over in the, the last minute of the second and then he won the, the third so wait, listen it was a tight fight and that kid he stopped three out of his five fights out there so do you know what I mean? To get in there and have given me the toughest fight he had in the competition saves a lot, do you know what I mean? So yeah, really without a doubt, mate, without a doubt. And uh, and here you are, you've only been back two days and you're in the gym. No, I haven't been back two days. I've when did you, when back did you come back Sunday? Last night. <laughs> last night. <laughs> no rest for the wicked? Definitely not. Well, so what's on the cards for you now then, mate? Uh, I don't know, I'm going to sit down with my coach to have a chat. Well, I'm, I'm automatically on GB now. Now I've, I've got a medal at a major. Uh, so I'm automatically on GB for three months. I get that email whenever they send it out. Uh, or either I turn pro. It's, it's all down to what my coaches think and and whatever's best for me as well, obviously. So. Well, when you 18? I'm 18 already. Oh right, I'm 18 you're already. So I was 18 in in September. So right. if I've got world well, that at my feet anyhow. So. Ready. Well, I see you've got plenty of options. Of course, yeah, of course. With that medal round your neck now. Um, it's going to open quite a few doors for you, hopefully. whatever way you want to go. Yeah, hopefully, hopefully. Um, and how was it like, uh, I mean, it's always nice to win a medal, but you did it with your mate as well. Yeah. Because Levi yeah. won uh, bronze yeah. as well. He's not just me mate, he's, he's like another brother to me. Me and Levi's, we've just been teammates. So we've been, we've trained with each other since being, God knows what age. We've, you know what I mean? So, we've created a good bond, not just through team, teammate, eh? through a friendship too, do you know what I mean? He's like, he's like another brother to me, Levi. Is. Well, this is what's great about this, like, you see, um, when Sharp Sound shuts down, yeah, it's shut down, you all eventually migrated down to here. Yeah. And it seems like home from home for you, yeah, though, isn't yeah, it? Yeah, of course, no. Listen, it's, for us to move from, from each other, it'd, it'd be, you know what I mean, it'd be devastating. You know what I mean? Because all from training all them years to, to not training them, from it to be, you know what I mean? It's, it's, it's a has it made it easy for you then? Of course it has. Well, it must have been a shot when that, when that it's shot not, out and, and, and suddenly... Course, it's, not just, it's not just made it easier, it's made it, you know what I mean, to push you harder. Yeah. You know what I mean? It's made us, it's made us better fighters, because when you're around good people who's, who's doing, wants to do good and winning good things, they're pushing you on in the gym, you're training hard, they're training hard. Do you know what I mean? It makes you a better fighter, obviously. Steel sharp and steel. Of course, yeah, of course it does. Of course it does. You put someone in a bad crowd, they end up a bad person. You put someone with a good crowd, they be a good person, you'd imagine. Yeah. So anyhow, nine times out of ten you see that. Not bad your family though, is it, eh? No, it's not little too bad. Brother, little brother picking up a silver at the uh, uh, European Juniors. Yeah, and, my, big, uh, my big brother has too. He, he got silver as oh, a schoolboy. Oh, did he? Was that William? Yeah, he got silver as a schoolboy in Russia. He got beat off the Russian in the final. I didn't know that. I knew he won a couple of yeah. national titles. Yeah, all of all of all three of his brothers have won a major for England now. Won a major medal for England. Some genes, then, isn't it? Yeah, it's not too bad, is it? Not <laughs> too bad. Um, I, listen, I, I just commend you, mate. It's uh, it's brilliant. I love your your work ethic. Uh, you just just relentless, all of you. You your kid. You, you're in here every day. And you really give it because you help to bring on all these other kids yeah, here now. Yeah, yeah, that's what we hope for, and yeah, not just to, not just to push each other on. I mean, we push whatever gym we're at to push on them better too. We want everybody to do well in the world. You don't want anybody to do bad. Well, this is already working. We had Corey uh, who ended yeah. up winning his um, first national life. title, yeah, yeah. and uh, we've got Owen uh, Little, yeah. who, who's or could be uh, a two times yes, national yeah, champion yeah, this year. Winning the development. And there's a young lady in there as well, she's going in the. Yeah, uh, yeah Emily, she's going yeah. for a national title. Hopefully they do the best, do the business at the week and, uh, on the 10th. Uh, now, listen, it's, it's proven what the jab's happening in the gym, mate. It's, it's making everybody better, so we're doing something right, aren't we? We can't complain with it. Without a doubt, without a doubt. But uh, I've come here to talk to uh, Dave and Mike because 
they've got a, a, their last show of the year, amateur show, and uh, I'm going to have a chat with them and we're going to see uh, yeah. who's on it. And uh, but this, 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 not just like I say, not just you and your kid, but the, the whole gym's full of talent now, yeah. isn't it? Yeah, it's, it's buzzing at the minute. It's buzzing. Can't oh. wait to see the old show. To be fair, I was meant to be on it myself, but. Coming back from them. I, I presume you're going to be down there, maybe. Yeah, I'll, I'll be definitely focus. there watching it. Yeah, I'll be definitely there watching it. I was meant to be boxing on the show myself, but coming back from them worlds to be on weight again two weeks later, it's a big, big ask for me. I've, I've dieted for, for six, seven weeks, so. Is it hard for you to make the weight? Uh, it's hard. It's as hard as you make it. You know what I mean? If you diet, you, you'll make it not a problem. If you you go and eat shit, it's going to be hard for you. You know what I mean? It, it all depends on how hard I make it for me. Because you, how, how long did you, because that was your fifth fight, uh, the semi final, yeah, wasn't it? Yeah, four fight, fights prior to that. Yeah, yeah. And how long were those four fights over? Eight days. Eight days. Eight days. Oh, then five fights that I had was in the space of eight days. So it's hard on your yeah, body. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's not just even hard on your body, it's hard mentally. You know what I mean? If you're not physically strong, you're going to bar the tournament. You know what I mean? You need to be physically strong. You can't just think, oh, my body's aching, this is aching. You need to be thinking, I'm going to smash this up again tomorrow. Do you know what I mean? You can't be thinking, oh, I need to worry about my body, I need to worry about this, you need to worry about getting in there and winning your fight again. Well, listen, I, I, all I can say is uh, amazing achievement and. Uh, I, I don't know what's next for you mate, but you're the one kid that I've said for a many, many a year when I've watched you and filmed you in championships, you're the kid that always puts a smile on my face. Yeah. And I, I'm not the biggest lover of Southpaws, and uh, you're the one that I forget that's a Southpaw because you're so entertaining to watch. Uh, so whatever happens to you next, whether it's GB and, and going in the leaps and all that, or you turn up and hang up your vest, I don't know. But uh, I know I'll be following it uh, closely. Absolutely. Thank you very, very much. I'd yeah. like to say a big thank you to my sponsors as well. Of course you can. Uh, well, they've been running in this corner, haven't they? The yeah, ones who yeah, helped yeah, you. Yeah, the Sultan and uh, the Chirotherapy in Blackpool. Thank you very, very much. I'm hoping to get more as well, hopefully very, very soon. Well, well, uh, I think it'd be a good idea to jump on early yeah. because it could be an exciting journey this way. Ho hopefully, hopefully. Nelson, you take care, man. Thank you, Lee. Bye. Good to see you. For all boxing, Info, news and latest interviews, amateur and pro, across the north, click and subscribe. VIP, boxing promotions, also Twitter, Instagram and Facebook.